Um, another fight just got made between um, DC's uh, Lantez Fox taking on Demetrius Andrade October 21st in Verona, New York. I think it'll be a uh, Slazer's Fox, uh, maybe first or second time uh, being televised. What do you th think about Alantes Fox taking on uh, Demetrius Andre? Both fighters are undefeated. What do you think? Oh, uh, man, I, I, I don't really know. I, I haven't really watched him. I have seen him fight. I saw, in, my, in my opinion, it's an up for grabs fight. Okay. It's an up for grabs fight. I think uh, whoever wants it, uh, whoever wants it most. And I'm pretty sure both of them want it. Want it. So, hey, uh, I hope they both go out there just, you know, pull and go fight. Um, I, I can't, I can't call, um, I can't pick a side. Okay. Yeah. Okay. What do you think about, um, I think of another fight just got made, uh, Lomachenko, uh, Versus uh, Regandale, I think they'll be fighting December 9th. We, that's a big fight at 130 pounds. What do you think about that fight? Uh, I think Regandale's coming up from 26 to 30. Um, what do you think about that when Regandale moving up to 30 to fight uh, Lomachenko? Both guys very skilled. What do you think? Man, that's a great fight, man. I watched both of those guys train. And listen, both of those guys are at the bats, man. They do flips. They, do, they walk on their hands. <laughs> I've seen Lomachenko walk on his fists. Mm. Jump on his fist across the, across the ring, man. I mean, I I love Loma Chinko, and I watch uh, I watch um Rick and Dow. I, mm. I like him too. Mm. Rick and Dow has the style to beat Loma Chinko because he's so fast. Loma Chinko throws a million punches if you stay there a split second too long. Mm. But the thing is, Rick and Dow is not gonna stay there. He's like a cat. He's in and out. He's in and out. So we gotta see what. Lomachenko's game plan is gonna be. Mm. He got to come. He got to come with a real strategic game plan. It's gonna be a, like a a real strategic fight. Mm. Cause uh, I mean, it's just cause you know, Loma, I mean, Ray is gonna be in and out. He's quick, fat. Oh, it's gonna be. This gonna be. A, I can't wait to see it. Mm. I, actually, it's gonna be a fight. I think to mm. the average boxer, like you know, like you know, you have boxer fans that. Just want to see knockouts. Want to see Mike Tyson knock somebody out, or see right. Mike Tyson bite somebody. You know, guy. Right. But I'm talking about. I think it, it might. It might even be a born fight to mm. a, a fan like that. You understand what I'm saying? Okay. You you have to be a true boxer fan to see this fight because it, you got know, this fight is gonna take a lot of skill and a lot of strategy. Just just think about it. Have you seen both of these guys fight? Absolutely. Yes. Yeah. I mean, these guys, man, you got, I mean, it's going to be, uh, it's going to be a good one, man. I, I, like I said, I love Lomas Jingle, I love Ring and Dow. I can see Ring and Dow, I can see where you Ring and Dow getting him. It, it, it's going to be, it's going to be a good fight, man. I can't, I, I can't call that one either. It's going to be a good fight. I just, I just want to see what Lomas Jingle going to do to offset uh, Ring and Dow. Okay. Because, you know, like I said, he, he, like I said, uh, Lone Chico throws a million punches if you stay there a split second too long. Right. But Rick and Dow is not going to be there. So what is Lone Chico going to do to 